Get down! Hey, pick up, push left, push left, push left, push left. Alright, and that makes it like right here. Really. Bang, bang! Get down! Hey, pick up, push left, push left, push left, push left. Segurança, um dos povos. In, in this training was involved artillery and, and infantry as well. So I think the main goal was how to maneuver infantry and, uh, and use uh, artillery for, to call for fire. I think it was a, a very, very important goal for us. My view as a battalion commander to train with different countries or different nations together, it, for me, it's a different experience. My country, may, many countries or uh, may have a, a different experience, but I it happen and they're just having this exercise together, they're sharing very information that, that they have already. And may, many or some events may happen to us and we are sharing to other countries. I would say it's a big ex uh, exchange of experience for, uh, for the partnership. And I see it in a, in a positive way. Uh, we're currently uh, outside of Chisinau, Moldova, uh, doing a training exercise in the, the local area out here with the Moldovan army. Um, it's called Rapid Trident 23. Uh, the purpose of this exercise is to um, integrate infantry with the artillery world and then with forward observers, um, tying those three together and how that can make us uh, more effective, as well as using uh, overhead uh, UAS technology, um, drones, and different recon assets. We've got a lot of different partners out here um, in Eastern Europe that we've worked with in the past, Romania specifically, a lot that I've worked with uh, personally as well, and just increasing overall security um, inter interoperability in this region um, is something that we want to strive for. I think it's important just to know uh, how we fight, um, how they fight, how we fight, and how we can, um, you know, fight together um, because they respect, you know, our customs and how, how we like to operate and uh, we respect theirs and we're just trying to find a way to tie those together to make us, you know, as effective as we can be, um, you know, if, if something ever occurs that, that would require us to work together and integrate as a secure force. One of the biggest pieces that we've been trying to push is integration of indirect fires and then uh, the forward observers who is you know the individual embedded with the infantry who is trying to get eyes on um, you know the enemy target and then can call for fire on that target so um, learning how to integrate those systems learning how to plan for those systems 
um, is something that they've really improved on in the past couple of days. Um, so they're already learning how to set the conditions to make it, um, giving them the upper hand on the battlefield.